Hello everybody. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. Um, we're at the hospital but only for Landon's IBIG and I kind of wanted to do life update video because it's been a crazy couple of weeks. Whew, where do I even start? This is going to be a talking video and if that's not your thing then it's okay. You don't have to watch this one but uh, let's see. Gosh there's been a lot going on but um, we have had a kiddo that has been very sick the last couple weeks. We have been in urgent cares a few times. We've been at the emergency room that has just dealt with extreme nausea and vomiting and um, they can't figure out what's going on. So that has been very stressful. Um, just it's always in the back of my mind on how they're doing and so that's been very heavy because nobody wants their kids sick and I want answers and it feels like no matter what I do uh, we can't get answers so we're still trying to figure that out what's going on with them um, just just it sounds like we're gonna end up probably heading to Anchorage to get some help because we don't have a lot of pediatric doctors here so I think that's going to be the next step is flying down there so it's just been really heavy over the last couple weeks not only that but we have had the flu in our house. <laughs> and I'm only laughing because it's just, it's been crazy, okay? I tested positive for flu B um, after I had already been sick. I didn't know I had it. I actually saw the test at the store. They have like a flu A, flu B, COVID test. And I was like, I'm gonna get it just cause I wanna know. And um, tested positive for flu B. It was very faint because I was at the very tail end of it, but it was definitely positive. So we have had that in our house, which has taken most of us down. Landon and Lance, I think, are the only ones that haven't gotten it yet. And I thought we were done with everybody getting it. And yesterday, Addison started getting sick. So I think she's coming down with it. The kiddo that has been very nauseous also got the flu and then they were not able to keep anything down for days there was we had to go in twice now for fluids to just kind of get them boosted um, so there's that okay it's been quite eventful also an update on my mom I had a few questions on um, the mass that she had biopsied a few weeks ago Long story short, she went in for a surgery to clear her nose because she's had a hard time breathing out of one side of her nose. They went in to do the surgery. They found a very large mass and they immediately stopped. They biopsied it and said, I'm not touching it until we know what's going on. Um, she found a doctor in Houston that does these surgeries because it was very close to her brain. Um, she wanted somebody that does it all the time and she did get the mass removed yesterday surgery went great um, she is at my sister's house she'll be there for a while she is recovering a uh, little funny story <laughs> when she got out of surgery my sister was with them which is so sweet thank you Heidi for being there with mom and dad my mom had this like the nose thing okay you know when you have nose surgery and they put the band so it like catches the stuff that comes out of your nose but uh she's getting out of surgery and she's like are my lashes okay and so like Heidi's like laughing and my dad's like I want to draw a mustache on your little nose thing <laughs> so I amazoned a packet of sticky mustaches so she can stick them on her little nose thing <laughs> I'm hoping I get some pictures of that because it's gonna be hilarious we are still in full fall here. It is very gloomy and gross outside and we are getting the first sun, full Sunday, Sunday, day with sun in a very long time tomorrow. And I am so looking forward to it. It's honestly been so much doom and gloom, like just cloudy, rainy, gross for so long that's kind of put me into a funk and it's been hard to like come out of. So I'm looking forward to some sun. My body, like I, I could care less if it's cold. Obviously I don't prefer 40 below, but as long as it's sunny, even if it's just for the four hours of daylight we have, I am grateful for sun and my body needs to see sun. I need to like physically see sun. So I'm excited for tomorrow. I never actually showed this, but like three, maybe four weeks ago now, we went over to my mom's and helped her harvest the garden. And it was so fun. And my mom does it mainly so my kids can 
like pick potatoes and harvest and Natalie is really enjoying that stuff so so she does half of her garden they did a whole bunch of potatoes and um honestly it wasn't a super great turnout but they had a good time and they got cabbage and um I think they just had a really good time so I'm gonna throw you into some footage from that I took a few clips and a few pictures so here's that Honestly, the last couple weeks has been survival. Also, um, here at IBIG, obviously. There's my boy. We're just sitting here. <laughs> um, just a reminder to you guys, don't idle your vehicles next to air intakes where they have like signs. We walked in this morning to the hospital First of all, I was like, what are we walking into? There was like a guy with a full like head filter thing. And I was like, oh my gosh, somebody working at the hospital uh, was driving a diesel truck and idled their vehicle next to air intake. And it is this morning, it's so much better right now, but it was nauseating when we walked in here. The entire hospital smelled like very strong diesel to the point where I was like, do we have to be here? The lady was like, do you want to reschedule? But his infusions are timed. Um, like he has to have them at certain, you know, like every four weeks. And so we couldn't just say, we'll come back. But crazy, don't idle your vehicles next to air intake because that was pretty awful. <laughs> There's been a lot of good stuff, guys, that has happened. Last night we had a family night. We just, uh, we watched the new Garfield movie on Netflix and made some popcorn. It was like a nice little break from having sick kids, even though we did, Addison was sick <laughs> last night, but she just, just runny nose, like normal cold symptoms. But it was nice to sit and watch a movie as a family. Just, it's not even the watching the movie, it's all of us being in the same room together um, that I love so much. And we try to do that on weekends. It was a, this is actually a long weekend. None of the kids had school today. So I was grateful for that. So Lance is home with all of them. But I will say things are going to start looking up, okay? I'm just gonna put it out there. Things are gonna start getting better and we're gonna have a great cup. Like this weekend is gonna be so fantastic with the sun. I wanna get out, do some fires. Uh, I haven't done a fire since the last time we went camping, which was, well, four weeks ago because it was, we left the day he had his last infusion, which was exactly four weeks ago. So um, I need a fire in my life. This is, speaking of fire, that's my Woodlands hoodie. <laughs> I love it because it's super light and I'm a very warm person. And so I need lots of layers, but they can't be thick layers. It's going to be a great weekend. Hopefully I can pick up the camera again this weekend. I just kind of wanted to give you guys a filler video um, and hopefully I can get this up today. Uh, so you're seeing this in real time. That's strange for Jessica Violet. <laughs> also, if you didn't know, my name is Jessica. My last name is Violet. Some people call me Violet and that's okay. It does not bother me at all. But I think some people assume my name's Violet because I have two first names and it's Violet Vlogs, but it's really Jessica Violet. Anyways, now you know. <laughs> but we're gonna continue on. He's actually not even started on IVIG yet. He's just getting his fluids. So we've got the whole day. Anyways, thank you guys for being here. Thank you for always just 
supporting me in whatever I put out and want to talk to you guys about. Um, thank you for loving my laugh. <laughs> some people love it, some people hate it. I don't know. <laughs> I think it's only the miserable people that complain. Some people are like, you laugh way too much. I'm like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. That I all right, we're all good. He had to start his IVIG, the fluids were done. Anyways, um, sorry not sorry if my laugh annoys you. I suggest you find more happy things in your life. <laughs> all right, I'm going to end this one. Thank you guys for listening through if you're this far to me talking. Um, I feel like it was a little bit of a complaint video, but please don't think that's it at all. I'm just updating you on what's been going on. It's gonna be a great weekend. We're gonna have a good weekend. We're gonna have sun. Hopefully I can bring you guys along. Hopefully everyone's healthy. I think I need to make some chili because it's chili season here. All right, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and we will see you in the next video. Bye.